evening. Good evening. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to your English class. It's Wednesday. It's the middle of the week. Yes. <laughs> How Good do evening, you feel teacher. today? How was your day? Busy. It was busy. Busy. Okay, very busy. Yes, my day was also very busy and a little bit tidy with a lot of things to do. But thanks God we are here, we are alive, and we are in the English class, okay? So let's forget about our other, I mean, in your case, about your work, about your household chores. Right now, let's focus in the class, okay? So, okay. Do I have a volunteer to tell me what's the topic of today's class? What's okay. today's topic? Uh, Do you have an uh, idea? Yes, I review uh, the trip. We speak over the trip. Yeah. Mm, okay. Oh, about trip. Okay, about your trip. Oh, we'll see. <laughs> okay, class, I'm going to share my screen. And this evening, I will ask you to. Okay, today in, in the class, um, we are, I'm going to mute all the participants, okay? Because I, um, I hear some noises that interrupt uh, the class, okay? So um, if you want to participate or if you have any question or you want to say something, you can raise your hand um, using the reactions that you have in uh, below your screen. You can see this, um, this part. Um, um, let me see if I can share it with you. Okay, can you see my screen? Yes? The names? Uh, yes. Yes, we can see. Uh, yours. Step stop. Is it your computer? Your uh, computer? No, you you are you you can now you see my computer. <laughs> no, but I what I want you to show you is let me see, let me see if I can show you. I can't. What what I want you to sh uh to do is that in there is a. a there is an, an icon with reactions. If you click on that, it says levantar la mano or raise your hand. So you do it, okay? Yes, uh -huh. like this. You're gonna do it that like way. Like this. Exactly, Yancy, thank you so much. Thank you, so uh, very good, Kimberly. Can everybody do it, please? Can everybody raise your hand? Yeah, that's great. Yeah, I can see that everybody's doing it. Very good. Denise, Andrea, Alba, Albert, Carla, Aisa, Kevin. Okay, that's good. Very good. Okay. okay, so that was the practice. Now, guys, I'm going to share with you the class. The class number nine. Uh -huh. Ok, ya, ya podemos dejar de, de levantar la mano <ríe> Ok Vaya 
Okay, so what's today's topic? Yes. Yes, I see. What's the topic? Vocabulary, summer activity. Exactly, summer activities. Remember, if you want to participate, you have to raise your hands, okay? Just let me send the invitation to I again. Okay, very good. Yes, and today is Wednesday, July 28th, 2021. Let's see the agenda for today's class. Well, the objective is that by the end of this class, you will learn vocabulary uh, for discussing summer activities, okay? In the agenda, the activity number one is recalling previous knowledge. And we have this activity, what matching? Then in activity number two, we have describing the last trip you took. Um, in the activity number three, let's talk about summer activities or recreational activity. And activity number four, the last time I, so we're gonna combine vocabulary with the grammar, which is the simple past. And then we have the wrap up. So let's begin with the first activity, recalling previous class well matching. In this activity, you have to match the verb in the base form to its form in the simple past. Um, well, these are, e what type of verbs are these ones? Regular or irregular? Can somebody raise your hand? There are irregular. Remember Verbs. to raise your hand. Remember to raise your hand. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, Jancy? Yes, it's irregular verb. They are irregular, exactly. They are irregular verbs. Thank you so much. So what are you going to do? Okay, write in your screen, ahí en su pantalla. Eh, pueden, no sé si pueden ver la opción que dice anotar, ahí arribita. Anotar es un lapicito. ¿Pueden ver el lapicito? Muy bien, Ángela. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? Vamos a... We are going to match. Match the base form with the verb in past. What is the past of half? Exactly. Very half. good. Half. half. Okay. Vaya, vamos. todos vamos a tener la oportunidad de hacerlo, así que pueden usar el lapicito y jugar un ratito. Okay. Say, said, sleep, slept. Take, took, write, wrote, sing, sang, can, could, go, went. <laughs> Aha, I can see that you like it. <laughs> it looks like tripachuca. <laughs> okay, very good. So let's practice. Okay, let's practice. Have, have, sleep. Slept, right, wrote, say, said, right, sing, wrote. sang, can, sang. good, right, wrote, go, and went. Good. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Oh, take and took, right? <laughs> good job, everybody. I like that you participate. <laughs> Thank you so much. Okay, let's continue with the next activity. Oh, but I need to erase this. Okay, in this exercise, you have to find a mistake. Okay. So I would like some, if you please, can you tell me in the chat, you can use the chat to tell me what's the mistake in the number one. You can use the chat. Okay, and write to me what's the mistake in number one. Did she the work on work? Number two. Okay, uh, Patricia, you're, you're raising your hand. Uh, and did, we, did she the homework? Yes, she did. 
Ah, you are missing the verb, right? Did she do the homework? Yes, she does. No, remember the auxiliary is did in the past. Yes, did she did the homework. She did. She did. Yes, she did. Okay. Oh, we got a message on the chat. Veamos qué dice el mensaje. Did she do the homework? Thank you, Jan Sibet. Okay. Now, number two. They didn't went to the office. Isamar, what's the what's the, the problem the or verbs. the mistake? The verbs. The verbs. Uh -huh. the what is the correct form? Is, they didn't go to the office. Very good. So when you are talking in negative in the past, you use the auxiliary didn't. So the verb must be in the face. Go. They didn't go to the office. Thank you so much. Okay, Jenny Sanchez, can you tell me what's the, the mistake in number three? My mother not wanted to have dinner. What is the correct form here? My mother no wanted to have dinner. Or if you, if anybody knows, you Din. can write on the chat. Din. Ah, okay. Thank you, Lisette. Remember to raise your hand. My mother did not. Did not. Y aquí el verbo does it have to be in the past. It has to be in the base form. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yes, my mother did not want to have dinner because she is on a diet. Okay, number four. I slept only six hours last night. Remember to raise your hand. Yes, Carla Alejandrina. Or you can write on the chat, okay? I slept only six hours last night. What's the problem in this sentence? Aha, uh -huh. let's see the chat. I slept only six hours last night. Very good. Very good, Jancy. Yes, so the problem is that this is not a regular verb. This is an irregular. Uh -huh. It's irregular. And the correct form is slept. I slept only six hours last night. Okay, number five. Did you eat chicken today? No, I don't. What's the problem here? Kimberly, Elizabeth? Hello. Uh, is, did you eat chicken today? No, Excellent. I didn't. Okay, that is the first mistake. Did you eat the verb in the base form? No, I didn't. Aha. Uh -huh. Did you eat chicken today? No, I didn't. Okay. In the negative. No, I didn't. Very good, guys. I see that you have been working in the platform. <laughs> okay, so great, good job. Let's continue. In, the, in this activity we have describing the last trip you took. Well, I want to say thank you so much and congratulations because you, the majority of you sent the homework send the, the picture and also send the audio. And I, I, I haven't had the time to answer all of your messages, but I was listening to them, okay? So thank you for sending the audios. And um, in this occasion, you're going to work in pairs in the breakout rooms and you are going to talk about the last trip you took, okay? Try try to tell the story to your classmate. Well, here I have uh, my, my trip, my, the description of my, 
of my trip to Piedra Parada Morazan to in many places in Morazan I was listening to I, I think it was Jancy or Jenny I don't remember exactly but I this person was in Llano Muerto and I was there too actually this picture is close to Llano El Muerto in Perkin. It's a very nice place there. Beautiful place. You can use these expressions in the past. Yesterday, last Tuesday, last week, last month, last year, three days ago, five weeks ago, three months ago, or you can say in February, in January, in 2011, in 2020, 2019, etc. Okay? or on a specific date. So I'm going to create the rooms and you are going to talk about your experience, okay? Yes, Kimberly, do you have any question? No, sorry, I forget the slow down my... No, no problem, there's no problem. Okay, so let me create uh, the rooms, okay? We have 24 participants, so we're going to create invitations. Okay. Accept the invitation, please. Hello, Modesto. Hello. How are Good you? Evening. I'm fine. Thank you. And you? Mm, I, I feel good today. Thank you for asking. Is it raining right. there? Is it raining? The water falling down? Oh, yes. yes. Oh, okay. And where right do you now. live? Where do you live? Yes. Where do no. you live, Modesta? I live in Tenancingo, Cuscatlan. Tenancingo, Cuscatlan, yes. yes. I think it's near Cojotepeque. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay, Modesto, can you tell me about your experience? A trip that you have? Any vacation? or a place that you visited and you really like it? Uh, I, am, I am not prepared. You are not um, prepared. Okay, tell me about the things right. that you did today. What did you do today? Hello. Uh, today, I, I, uh, I, I did study. You studied? Okay. Yes, I studied. And then I, I, um, 
I am drawn, drawn. Okay. Okay, I draw. I I draw. I draw. I draw. I draw my car. Mm -hmm. And then I I ate pupusas. Oh, in the morning um, or in the evening? Yes. In the morning, I mm -hmm. ate pupusas. I love pupusas and too. Then, uh, <laughs> Hello. I love pupusas too. <laughs> Se cortó. Sigue cortando. Okay. Can you hear me? Ahora sí. Ahora sí. Okay. Yes. I said that I love pupusas too. Yes, I love pupusas. It is my favorite food it's with favorite tacos. Food. Oh, yes, tacos. Oh, I love Mexican food. Yes, I love the tacos. <laughs> I like tacos. And yes. Okay, uh, so at what time did you wake up today? What time did you wake up today? Uh, I wake up 6 a.m. Okay, because so I woke woke up at six a.m. I woke, I woke up, I woke up six a.m. because I had, I have a class. And I and I had class at seven a.m. Very early in the morning. Mm -hmm. Yes, I have a class. What time I, did you finish your class? Um, eight, eight thirteen. My eight class 15. finally, finally at eight thirteen. I know. Eight thirty. Eight thirty. Okay, eight thirty. Mm -hmm. Okay, eight thirty. Sorry, yes, sorry. <laughs> no, it doesn't matter. You're learning. Don't say sorry. Um, okay. <laughs> okay. And what about noon? What did you do at noon? Al mediodía. What did you do at noon? Um. I I visited my friend because mm -hmm. he he is uh, sad. Yes, he is sad. Está really? como, como no sé cómo decirlo. Depresión. Mm -hmm. He had depression. He has depression. depression. Really. He has depression. Yes. Mm. Um, entonces fui a verlo. But that's so, good. You did something very nice for your friend today. Yes, thank you. You are um, a good friend. Thank you. And also I I watched my car. Uh, it's my car. Oh, I you watched watch watch the car. Watch, yeah. I watched my I washed. I watched. Okay, there is a difference between watch, like watch TV, watch yes. a movie. Watch. watch. But washing the car, wash is, is different. It's like watch. when you are saying shh. Okay, washed. I washed, I washed the car. All right, I washed the car. Good, good okay. for you. Okay, okay, okay Modesto, uh, why don't you try to write the, the last, three, your experience in your last vacation or your last okay. trip, okay? And I'm going to check yep. the other groups, okay? See you later. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Miss.
Kumpulkan. Hai, sini Talio. Hello, Jay. Hello, Valisa. Hi, teacher. Can you turn on your videos, please? If it's possible, of course. Hello, teacher. Yo no enciendo la cámara porque estoy fuera y está lloviendo bien fuerte. Ah, bueno, ok. ¿Y usted, Elizabeth? <risa> Ay, me da pena. Pero... <risa> no, teacher, no me da eso. <risa> Elizabeth. Ok, uh, tell me about your experience. Sí, ese teacher que yo ahora me, me realmente me quedé como un poquito en la luna porque ayer de verdad que no me pude conectar porque se me inundó la casa. Oh, entonces, I'm so sorry ajá. for that. Sí, entonces de no me pude conectar por eso y estaba sacando el agua, ¿verdad? Entonces por eso ya ahora me quedé como un poquito en la luna y estaba buscando como un ejemplo que me había dicho Jenny, pero no lo encontré, o sea, más o menos para guiarme, ¿verdad? De allí, pero no lo encuentro, fíjese. Bye, Elizabeth. Si quiere, me escribe en el WhatsApp. Uh -huh. a mí, pero a mí personalmente, ¿verdad? Para volverle a enviar el ejemplo. Pero ah, si bye. ustedes se fijaron, ese era, es bien fácil hablar en pasado, ¿verdad? Porque usted primero uh -huh. pone el sujeto, que sería en este caso yo, vea, ay. Y luego tiene que usar el verbo en pasado. Uh -huh. Y eso es todo. ¿verdad? Sí, pero la, la historia que usted dejó era la que veíamos, un, o sea, un viaje, un viaje de, de, digamos, que lo hicimos en, en cualquier mes. Exactamente, o hace años. Pero es que yo hice uno corto porque igual no me quedó tiempo mucho ahora en el trabajo, ¿verdad? Está bien. Yo hice pues, uno ¿Quiere así. compartir? Solo a usted y, y a Elisa. Pues, pues sí, <risa> compártalo. <risa> Bueno, dice, my last three was to the line. Uh, ¿Cómo se dice Cuatepeque? Eh, eh. Lake, Cuatepeque Lake. Cuatepeque Lake, why my co-workers, we had a nice afternoon. We had a delicious uh, lunch. They uh -huh. went to a um, bar and ride. And the, uh, the line, the boy in the book tour is the story that the lines is very full afternoon. Can you repeat the last thing you said? Can you repeat? Uh -huh. The story? The story. Story. Story that, 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 that I like. That I like. Uh -huh. He's a very full afternoon. Uh -huh. A very nice afternoon. Yes. Afternoon. Hasta ahí me había quedado, teacher. <laughs> but it's great. I mean, you have the idea and you can continue making up the story. Okay. And then, okay, you can help Elizabeth. Do you have the idea now? Ya tiene la idea, Elizabeth, de lo que tiene que hacer. Más o menos, sí tiene. Vaya, es ahí. Que, uh -huh. ajá, es que estoy, mero, estoy un poco faltita para el inglés, entonces. ¿Quién le ha dicho eso? <risa> no, yo, o sea, que casi no entiendo. Pero sí, más puede? o menos. <risa> ¿Y cómo van en la plataforma? Pues yo voy en la sección 4 ahorita. Uh -huh. Yo también te eché en la sesión 4. Va, esta Pero vez vamos bien, bien, ¿verdad? En la 4. Son cinco secciones, ¿verdad? Pero yo digo que ese fin de semana va a avanzar y va a terminar la 5. Uh -huh. <ríe> ok, that's great. Oh, we need to come back to, to, the, to the class with all the people, with all the students. Hello guys, thank you for sharing your experiences. 
I would like one participation, one person to share with all the class your story about the last trip or your last experience. Remember to raise your virtual hand. Can I have a volunteer to share with the class? Only one, only one. I, I, I don't need all of you. Only one participant. <laughs> okay, Patricia. Okay, bueno. No sé si me van a escuchar por las tormentas, pero igual. Bueno. Try to shout, okay? <laughs> Try to shout so that we can hear you. The last trip I took was in February 14, 2021. My family and some friends went to El Pimental Hotel in the Pacific Coast, a comfortable place to stay and fun in the pool or in the beach. The food is very delicious and not more expensive, but we had to wait for the lunch about 40, 45 minutes. And that was so boring. However, we enjoyed it, the sun, beach, and cold drink. Congratulations! Okay, I was just um, make an observation in the pronunciation of the verb enjoy in the past tense is enjoyed. Enjoyed. Okay. Good job, Patricia. Thank you for sharing your experience. Okay, guys, I know everybody wants to participate. Then I really appreciate that, but we need to continue with the other part of the class. Okay. So um, now let's talk about recreational activities, not only summer activities, but also recreational activities. And um, to talk about them, we use some collocations with the verb play, go and do. For example, Okay, play, we have here soccer, football, judo, skating, basketball, boxing, bowling, ice hockey, gymnastics, golf, dancing, table tennis, rugby, press ups, swimming, running, hockey, kung fu, athletics, aerobics, puzzles, volleyball, fishing, yoga, cycling, sailing, skiing, cutlery or karate, Chess and hiking, okay? Like hiking a volcano or hiking a mountain. So which words would you use with play? Please raise your hand. Or you can, um, or you can write on the chat and tell me with play. Let's see, for example, yes, Isama? Play what? Play? Football. Okay, play football. Okay, another one. Let's see, Jenny Sanchez. Play basketball. Play basketball. Okay. Play soccer. Alguien escribió ahí play soccer. soccer. And that's good. Somebody wrote play golf. Yes. Play volleyball. Thank you so much. Uh -huh. Any other game? Play chess. Play, Play golf. table tennis. Golf. Table nine. Play yoga. No, yoga is with do. Do. Very good. Yoga. Okay, let's go Play. with golf. Play golf. Yes, golf. Golf yes. Is there. Okay, what about with go? Go. Yoga. Eh, no. Isama? Go dancing. Go dancing. Yes, go dancing. Go. You can go dancing to a disco. Go. Jenny Sanchez? Swimming. Go swimming, very good. Go fishing, go bowling. Thank you for your for sending the messages. Go cycling. Perfect. So please, in your notebook, you can write the categories. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, go dancing, go fishing, go cycling, uh, go skiing, but not in El Salvador, but in other, in other, <laughs> in other places, in other countries. Go skating. Let me see the chat. <coughs> go running. Thank you. Go bowling at Galaxy Bowling. So, great, yes. Now we do. Chess. Do. Aerobics. Yoga. Do yoga. Do aerobics. Oops. Swimming, gymnastics. Do yoga, do aerobics, karate, do karate, 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 do gymnastics. Let me see the chat. Swimming. Swimming is go, go swimming. Ah, okay. Boxing, loose, do. Puzzles, do press ups or push ups. Push ups. Push -ups. Or press ups. Mm -hmm. Do. But that's me, rugby. Rugby. That is play. Rubai. Play. Do play. Rubai. Play chess. Rugby. What does me? Do puzzles. Okay. Puzzle. Mm -hmm. Puzzles. Thank you so much, guys. Okay, so here you can see we play games or sports. We play football, we play basketball, we play soccer, we play golf, we play volleyball, we play chess, and we play table tennis. Okay, we play games and sports. What now, about go, rugby? What about rugby? Yes, that, that would be play rugby, play rugby. Thank you, Yancy. Okay, with go, we have go ex um, activities, outdoor activities. Outdoor activities, activities that you do outside your house. Go dancing, go fishing, okay, in a river or in a lake or in the ocean. Go cycling with your bicycle. Go skiing in the snow. Go skating in the park. Go running in the morning on the street or in the park or in your neighborhood. Go bowling. It's like playing that game. Mm -hmm. And we do, we have do yoga, hacer yoga, do aerobics, hacer aerobicos to exercise, right? Ah, do exercise too, do karate, do gymnastics, do press ups, <laughs> to build muscles and do puzzles, the games. It's a mental exercise. Okay, now let's go to the next. Uh, now the practice, the practice. But I need to erase this first. Okay, in the practice, what time is it? It's 8.40, okay. In the practice, we have this activity, the last time I. So we're going to combine the activities with the, the la, um, the last experiences or the last time, la última vez que yo hice estas actividades. So you're going to talk about the last time you did the following activity. You can see here the woman doing some push-ups or press-ups. You can see the, the, the kids going cycling and you can see the boy playing or doing a puzzle, doing a puzzle, okay? So you are going to 
talk in your groups about the last time you went cycling, the last time you went swimming, the last time you played soccer, the last time you did exercise, the last time you took a picture, the last time you played, oh, here it has to be in the, in the present, in the past, played. Me comí el ide. I'm sorry. I played. The last time I played a musical instrument, the last time I met an interesting person, the last time I went dancing, the last time I did puzzle, the last time I played a musical instrument, oh, it's repeated. And the last time I did some push-ups, okay? I want to share my experience, okay? Uh, can somebody ask me uh, or give me a number from two to 12 and ask me about when was the last time you, when was the last time you, can somebody ask me? You can raise your hand. Okay, teacher, when was, cuando fue, when was the last time you went or you did something? Yancy? Okay, ask for you, okay. You can, you ask, you ask me. Ask for, yes, for you. When the last time you meet an interesting person? Thank you. The last time I met an interesting person was two weeks ago. Well, actually it was not an, yeah, he is an interesting person, but he's also a very um, famous or very important person in, in the country because he's a businessman. He is the owner of Avianca, Roberto Crit. And so uh, we were, I worked for the foundation Gloria Crypt and during the day. So um, we were in an event for all the employees and um, he was there, okay? And he, uh, um, he talked to me. So I could say that, that the last time I met an interesting person was two weeks ago, okay? <laughs> So you are going to try to talk about these experiences in the breakup rooms, okay? Um, you have these, um, um, let's say these, this slide or this presentation in your group, in the WhatsApp group. But anyways, I'm going to share, I already sent the picture with the with the, um, with the statements so that you can complete and practice. Va, entonces nos vamos a los grupos y hablamos sobre esto, ¿ok? Remember, when was the last time you... Ahorita hago los grupos y se meten a los grupos, ¿ok? Oh, I'm sorry. Give me ten only. Hello. Hello, Lisa, Angela. Uh, 
I, I did yoga, was in 1998. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. And you, when was the last time the you take a picture? Okay. You yeah. took a picture. Took. When was the last time you took a picture? Okay. Uh, the last of time I went to gimnasio. Teacher. Verónica, Isamar le está preguntando cuándo fue la última vez que tomó una foto. When was the last time you took a picture? Ah. Teacher, no puedo decir the, when was the last time did you took, take? Did you take? No, porque ya está haciendo la pregunta. ¿Cuándo fue? Esa es la pregunta, ¿verdad? When was the last time you took a picture? Thank you. Uh, um, when, when do you, no, it's what's bad. Uh, the last time I took a picture was yesterday in my anniversary with my boyfriend. That was the last uh, time I took a picture. Okay, okay. the last time um uh, is day is the day <laughs> this last time today uh, today a uh, uh, victory i took a picture today really why okay oh the classmate who is other? I picture Carla Alejandrina. Today. She loves my picture today. Veronica, ask the question, uh, Carla Alejandrina, please. Oh. Okay. Uh, Carla? The last time and when she the last the last time um so yeah the last time I played soccer was in the year twenty. 15. 15. Really? Yes. <laughs> okay. And who did you play football with? With your friends, with your family, with your classmates? My friends. With your My friends. friends. Yes. yes. Okay. When was the last time you ate cake? That question is not there. But when was the last time you ate cake? Okay. Mm. The I last don't time eat cake. It came. I is... the last time I ate cake. I was... ate cake was June. In June. Um, Why? In June. Uh, because bright day, my bright day, my father. It was your father's birthday. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Great. Continue practicing, please. Thank you, teacher. The last time I. <laughs> Ya, yo creo que ya nos están solicitando entrar. 
No. No. No, no yet. Ah. <laughs> I, I'm just here checking that you are practicing. Ah. I want to hear Okay. You. Okay. Me está preguntando um, la number seven. Ajá. Uh -huh. Repeat, please. Yo le repito, estoy hablando de seis. Por favor, la please. seven, usted. Number seven. Number seven. Uh, the last time I played musical instrument was. Okay, mm. if you ask a question, you have to say when was, cuando fue, when was the last time you played a musical instrument. Pero se los mandé al, al, al grupo la pregunta. A ver. La pregunta de eh, Seven sería The Lampstein a Play. Esa sería la no. respuesta. Pero la pregunta sería: When was the last time you played a musical instrument? Mm, the last time I played a musical instrument was, uh, oh, wow, when I was a little mm -hmm. kid, maybe I was mm -hmm. 10 years old, and I had a very old neighbor that he used to teach me how to play the guitar, but I am not good at playing the guitar, so I didn't learn, but that was the last time I played a musical instrument. What about you, Kevin? Uh, last time I played musical instrument was the Sunday in church. On Sunday? Yeah. Really? Sunday. Oh, what musical instrument did you play? Uh, for bass and drum. The bass and the drum. Okay. Do you belong to a group, a music group? band or a musical group yes it's yes okay in your church in your neighborhood or where sí. no lo entiendo mucho pero... <laughs> en la iglesia en el vecindario o a donde sí, está en ese grupo este en la iglesia yo toco en mi iglesia y también tenemos una banda con unos muchachos así de afuera de las iglesias Okay, that's interesting. Yeah, that's good to know. What about you, Fatima? Fatima, when was the last time you did exercise? Um, today. Oh, today okay. in the morning. Uh huh. Um, in the park already. Alrededor, no sé cómo. Around. Around. De, de eh, parte, eh, de... Ok. And what did you do? Do you run? Or what eh, kind of exercise do you do? Um, ¿Qué tipo de ejercicio hace? Caminar. You walk. Y trotar, you walk. And jog. Um, okay, that's great, right, Fatima. That's great. Right. Yeah. That keep that keeps you healthy, and and thin. That's why you you are in good shape. Okay, mm -hmm. one day I will be like you. <laughs> okay, now we need to come back to. Okay. Okay. Please continue practicing. Okay, by your own. Okay. But you are doing great. Okay, wow, I like when the students speak about their experiences because you see that 
you have very interesting experiences. For example, I didn't know, but Kevin can Kevin uh, can play musical instruments. The last time he played a musical instrument was last Sunday. He played the bass and the drums. Mm -hmm. He belongs to a music group in his church. Oh, so that's great, Kevin. That's great. Okay. I would like a, a participation. Okay. Can somebody participate and share one of your, your classmates' experiences? Not talk about you, but maybe one of your classmates' experiences. You can tell me, for example, uh, the last time, I'm going to tell you this example. The last time Fatima did exercise was this morning. She went running in, around the park. Now, can you tell me about one of your classmates? Me pueden decir sobre sus compañeros con los que practicaron? Don't be shy, guys. You have to participate. That's why you're here in the class to practice. Okay, Veronica? Mm, uh, Carla, Alejandrina, eh, Till last time I went swimming, what Sunday? Okay, the last time Carla went uh, swimming was last Sunday, okay. Carlita, where did you go? Where did you go swimming? Uh, Dolce Vita Beach. Okay, you can. I went swimming to Dolce Vita's beach. Mm. Thank you so much, Carlita. Okay, any other person? Did you pay attention to your classmates? Patricia Herrera. Okay. She was. Dancing, Patricia Herrera, she was dancing when a, a boy, a girl. Patricia Herrera, she was dancing when she, cuando era girl, una niña. Ah, ok, the last time, ok, así sería la estructura, miren. La última vez que Patricia se fue a bailar fue cuando estaba pequeña. Entonces sería, the last time Patricia went dancing was when she was a little girl. When she was a little girl. ¿Ok? Ok, the last time they were a little girl. Yeah. When she was a little girl. Okay. Isamar? Thank you. Okay. Uh, the last time Veronica took a picture was today. Oh, uh, what, I mean, what, what, kind, what type of picture did she take? Or, or what did you photograph? Oh, I don't remember. <laughs> you don't remember. Veronica, what did you photograph? No, no, not, not nothing. Y entonces, ¿por qué yeah. dice que ahora tomo fotos? <laughs> <laughs> ok, uh, guys. Tifón, uh, tifón. Yeah, you took a picture with your cell phone, but what? Pero mm. que, que, a qué le I Ah, nice. Yourself. A selfie. Yourself. You took uh, a selfie. Yes. Ah, okay. Uh, <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Guys, it's nine o'clock. Can you imagine? Okay, so let's run with the wrap up. Um, tell me, what did you learn today? 
What are your favorite recreational activities? What are you going to do on your next vacation? And what activity did you like in today's class? Okay, I need four volunteers. One to answer the first question, the second, the third, and the fourth one. Okay, what did you learn today? Si no hay voluntarios, yo voy a pedir aquí víctima. Yo voy a asignar víctima si no hay volunteers. What did you learn today? ¿Qué aprendiste hoy, Patricia? I did. Patricia Herrera? Okay. Um, today I learned about uh, the scribe, the activities uh, at the day. Okay. The experience of, okay, an experience in past. The activities. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. What are your favorite Favorite recreational activity? My favorite, my favorite recreation activity is the, the activity three. I am going to mute the participants. <laughs> no sé si pueden cerrar su micrófono. Gracias. Okay. Uh, what are you going to do on your next vacation? Denis Urquiza? Hi, teacher. What are you going to do on your next vacation? I mean, next week. I'm going to visit uh, my mother's house. And I, I study. I'm going the, to study. I'm going to study my subjects of jun, uh, university. Okay. And, and I'm going to exercise on the next week. Okay, very good. I'm, I want to tell you what I'm going to do. On my next vacation next week, I'm going to visit a nursery plant. This is a nursery plant. Uh, with my cousin, and I'm going to uh, to buy. Uh, I I ate the you. I'm going to buy some plants and trees for my garden. Okay, I love I love flowers and plants and trees. Okay, what activity did you like in today's class? What was your favorite activity in today's class? Patricia Veronica Salazar. Um, I like to um, question and answer answer the, the last time. <laughs> okay, thank you, Veronica. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. You like to ask and answer questions about the last time. Uh -huh. the last okay, time. you talk about past experiences. Very good. Okay, guys, I had a good time with you. So thank you so much for being here connected. And remember, you have to work on the platform. You have to finish all the sections in the midterm so that you can get your certificate, okay? So please rest well and take care and have a good night. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Teacher. Bye. Bye. Bye.